today I am going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is The Brave and Beautiful Queen Esther. Let's read. Esther was a queen of Persia. Even her husband was King Xerxes. King Xerxes didn't know her secret. Esther was Jewish. Esther's cousin Mordecai worked the, at the palace to look out for her. So El Esther was a queen of Persia, and her husband King Xerxes didn't know that she was Jewish. Xerxes Haman received a great reward. He was very proud. Everyone except Mordecai bowed down to him. Haman was insulted. He moved to kill Mordecai and all the Jewish. So... Haman, Xerxes' adversary, had a great weaver, but except Mordecai, everyone bowed down to him. Mordecai didn't bow down to Haman, so Haman was going to kill the Jewish. Haman told Xerxes that the Jewish are dangerous and should die. Xerxes agreed and sent a day to kill him. Mordecai was terrified and sent a message to Queen Esther. So Haman told Xerxes that Jewish was very dangerous people and they should be killed. So Xerxes agreed and made them die and Mordecai was so terrified to see that. So he held to Queen Esther. Question, Haman wanted to kill the Jewish people. True. Oh, we have got a one star. Change the king's mind, Mordecai said. If I go to him, we stop his invitation. He can have me killed. A stern reply. Perhaps your mate coin just for this moment, said Mordecai. So, Mordecai has sent a message to Queen Esther. And if the if King doesn't and the invited the queen whoever 
at the stand, they sh they should be killed. So like more, Esther was afraid of that. And Mordecai said to the Queen Esther that your maid, your maid by coin just for this moment. Esther bravely agreed. Wait a minute. Esther bravely agreed to try. She went to the throne room. King Xerxes was amazed by her beauty and invited her. Can I have dinner with Taman? She asked. So Esther bravely agreed and tried. And she asked for them to pray for her. And she have gone into King's room. Throne room. And the king was amazed by her beauty and invited her. If the king didn't invite the church, then they should be died. But if king give that stuff thing, then they will not die. Question. Who told Esther to change the king's mind about killing the Jewish number one? Haman. Not Haman because Haman was like trying to kill the Jewish number two Mordecai number three the Jewish number two was the correct answer Haman was building a big gallow in his backyard he planned to hang Mordecai on it then the king's invitation arrived so Haman went to the palace for dinner So Haman was building a big gallow for Mordecai that when it is the day to kill Jewish like Haman was going to have Mordecai there. And that time the king of the arrived to Haman's house. wants to kill me and my people. The Jewish Esther told Xerxes. Who did such a thing? He asked. The evil Haman. Esther cried. Haman guards put him to death. So Haman was invited also. So like Oh, okay, the king was amazed by her beauty and said, What should I do for you? And Esther said that someone is going to kill me and my people, the Jewish. And like Xerxes was surprised that who have, who will do such a thing? And Esther told that it was Haman. So Haman said, the king asked God to put him into the bed. Wait, the next thing I saw, gem. Oh, I didn't saw. So Haman was hanged on the gallow he had built for Mordecai. 
because of Esther, the Jewish were saved. They celebrate with a great feast, feast which they observe to this day. So Hannah was had on the gallow what Mordecai have made. Hannah has made for Mordecai. They're looking really happy, right? We have found the Bible gem. Question. God allowed Esther to be the queen at this time for saving Jewish people from death. True. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy it? And next time I will read another good story. And let's see you next time. Bye!